let's talk about a trip to Mississippi. Do you like Yes, we are headed to Vicksburg, Mississippi. And the kids are highly entertained by their fidget spinners that came. Oh, oh, we have three. We have a fidget spinner with poppers. And a reindeer. And a reindeer, a Rudolph. No! And a popper. And Daddy has a Christmas tree popper. Go ahead. It's a popper, but it's a fidget spinner too. Look with your eyes, not with your hands. This is squishy. Mm -hmm.
What? Come here. Hold on, I'm videoing. Mommy. Oh, your clothes slip. It's gonna rain soon. You think so? Yeah, look. Look out. Mommy, look at the nice, light cruise ship. Yeah. Mommy! Hey, Jenny, nice, light cruise ship. Yeah. Oh, oh, Jenny, cruise ship. Uh-huh. Alright, let's go down. Yeah. Let's go explore the floor we were supposed to do. sugar or something like I need some I feel real lightheaded right now. There's a casino. Oh in okay. one mile turn left to merge onto I-20 East. Oh, look at that big bridge. I think that must be the interstate. We didn't go over that bridge though. I think uh, Louisiana's on the other side, right? Probably. Are we going on this bridge? Yeah, yeah casino. Hey, we Mississippi go. River Overlook. Can we go there? I don't care. Huh? I don't care. Oh, there's the a the big bridge. bridge. Okay. Start what? Around. We're gonna go to the overlook right now. Yeah. Turn right onto North Frontage Road. Turn left onto Louisiana Circle. Then take a slight right turn onto Washington Street. This is cool. It is Wednesday, I believe, the 29th of December. And um, where's the little guy back there? The big guy has gone to get uh, toilet paper is the number one item on his toilet list. Toilet paper. Our Airbnb did not have, it had one roll of toilet paper, like incomplete roll of toilet paper. So we have used that and we now have zero. 
So we are staying in an Airbnb um, right uh, three in, for three days, three nights, yeah. Right in the downtown um, Vicksburg area. And it's very nice. It is very nice. It is the the halls are decked with Christmas like decorations. Pepper Pig. There's a gym. It's not Piggy. It's Pepper. Mhm. Mm and there's a game also. Game. So and it's in a old Sears Roebuck building. And it's very nice, even though my parents are in Sears Old, but it's still nice. That's right. It's a it's a very old building, but they have renovated it. And it doesn't look very old. Yeah, so it looks very nice now. It's nice and clean. It's a great a Airbnb. Um, we yeah, are but it doesn't really look like an Airbnb. Kind of. It looks like, like a building. But it doesn't really look like where you like the actual guy stay in. But it's still pretty nice, though. Yeah. But it doesn't look like it on the outside or the inside. It does look like that. And on Christmas, they have like little trees that like... Oh, so uh, we went down, so we're on the bottom. Yeah, we're on the second floor. Second floor. And um, no. we have these like a tree, a candy tree. And on the first floor, we like a, a green tree. And on the second floor, where we stay, is like a yellow, a, like a white tree. Yeah. It has, and the white tree is filled with candy. Also, I'm sure it's going to be nice if you have a white tree with candy on it. That's cool. But it's more bigger. Mm -hmm. So, um, so today we got up and and got showered and everything. Yeah, and and, then, and we haven't like been in our Airbnb for a while, and so I'm really hot and tired. <laughs> but I still like it. I, I still like it. I still like going out. I said that was kind of good. Way too freaking good. And I said I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. So we're thirsty and tired. Yeah. So we um so we started our day at about eleven probably by the time um, we should actually Sure. Um and then we went to oh some kind of sixty coffee sixty one, oh, highway sixty one no, coffee I need place. A Okay. Also, it's rain, so there's like a little drop on here too. But it stopped raining. It's been raining for like it's been sprinkling and done, and then we're in the car. It rained a lot, then it like stopped. Like it, it stayed. We got here. Yeah. It's, we are at Walmart though. We are at Walmart now. So um, and oh, then yeah. we're in the coffee shop. So it it was looks like you don't see um raindrops, but I can see raindrops. It's like. Mm -hmm. But it looks sunny. You can see right here. It looks sunny. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. So um, the sun has just come out too, actually. So we um, in the coffee wow. shop. We met some people that are either close to, to this area or have lived in this area. Yeah, we, we don't live here, by the way. Right. Yeah. And um, we. Um, so they kind of set us off on our trail. Yeah, and, and they gave us like uh, this nice this paper, and it wasn't even look like it didn't even look good. But they, but, <laughs> but they just gave it to us, and we went and we were like, cool. And also, when we were coming here, there was a bucky store, and I got rock candy, and it was very nice. So it's kind of hard. Yeah. And I didn't finish it, so I just it's still there though. Rain. Yes, we've Thank been you. to the Georgia Buckies and we did the um, Alabama Thank Buckies you. this time. Uh, the Alabama Buckies was a little oh, different because it's like no, like sideways and because the bees was on the Georgia, the bees was on this side, on the, on the other side, the other area, the bees was on this side. So after we got our coffee and the people shared with us some things to do, so then we went over um, basically almost across oh, the street to the train museum. We're going to stay focused to the train museum. And um, that was about $10 for all of us to um, partake in that experience. And that man there gave us each a passport, which made the made it all so much more fun. I should find those passports. Also, also I got some things to show you. So we went to the passport. Yes, yeah, so this is the passport. Mm -hmm. And then we went to like some place, like we went to fun places, and we got a sprite somewhere. I forgot what it's called. 
Todd. Okay, now let's go in sequential order though. Let's talk about it in sequential order. You're jumping ahead, okay? So we went to the train museum and then we went to, I don't know, Lower East Mississippi oh, Museum. Oh, I don't know the yeah. exact names, but we went to this Mississippi Museum that was free. It was huge. There was a video. Um, all kinds of things we could tour. That was totally okay. So we went to the Miss the Mississippi Museum, which was free. Across the street, oh, there was another museum. Oh, wait, something that was inside the like um, train. It's the same thing like, where we saw all the toy trains, like all the trains that move around mm -hmm. and got the past boats. Um, there were like there was a place a big. Hotel, was it? Was it a hotel? Well, I think it was like some kind of ship or something, right? No, no, not that. Like, you know, where the train was and no. you know, where that big building was. Mm hmm. Like the big building that had like the things and like all of it. That was Steven. A hotel. Oh, that was a big like m mansion, like maybe yeah. even Victorian mansion. Yeah, but it's somewhere like oh, also. She was like, so they were having a party, and one person, one person left the candle bunny. The and cigar. They, and the cigar bunny, and then a butt lay on it, but we still pieces of it left. That's it's right. like white poles still left. Columns of the mansion that are still remaining. Yes, yeah, so we're going to go visit that at some point, like the actual site. It's uh, here where we are. Right, right. That was good. Okay, so um, after the train museum, free Mississippi museum across the street, another free museum. I believe his name was Patrick Kelly. There was a lot of information about him in there. He was a fashion designer from oh, Vicksburg. Also, there was a cool dress. Like, it was blue. He likes buttons. Yes, he likes buttons. He, he uses loves. loves buttons. He uses buttons a lot in his fashion. So he like had like blue dress that was had long sleeves, and if he put blue buttons, pink buttons, yellow buttons, uh huh, all over it. Yeah. yeah. Not all over it though. He yeah. Blue covering. Yeah. Also, uh, he and made like a cheetah outfit, and he also had buttons. And it was pretty. Yeah, my teacher. Um, so, and then I believe, um, apparently what the lady told us in the museum is that he was not, his, like, he was not really accepted or his fashion wasn't accepted or something here in Vicksburg at that time. And so he went, went to, to Paris. Paris, yes. Um, really cool story too, because somebody like anonymously like bought him a ticket to Paris so that he could end up there and everything. And, and he... his career just like you know, boosted and, and everything and um probably loved it. Yes. And um I think he ended up designing for many famous people oh, like Princess like... Diana was one of those people. Oh Diana. Oh well, then we went to put our name in for lunch and then they called us when it was available. Oh, the wait. kids were so no, thirsty. And we got this right here. But we like put it in cups so we will like break it and like share it. Probably break we mm -hmm. like, and this is an old spot. It's right, and the idea of bottling, like in glass bottles, the soda started here in Vicksburg. I wonder how they still have this because it's actually real spot. Yeah. Ah. And then after we ate lunch, the place we ate at was great. And um, yeah, and I, I I got fish fries and a burger, and I got to put my and I didn't want cheese. I still like. And actually, it was not so cool. It's square. Yeah, it had a square bun, right? Yeah. And then he we went the to like the Coke the Museum, which was nine dollars and fifty cents. So we have spent probably about four hours here, and um, it looks like we've got our toilet paper now. So oh, that's yeah, good. yeah, yeah. I see him. And I see him. we have paid what about twenty dollars yeah. for our it's all of those experiences for four hours so yeah, and um then I we got some rain and now we're gonna go oh. and chill a little bit and we have netflix which is something we do not have at the house so, so it it's exciting to be able to catch up on some netflix shows and yeah, even in that it says museum, that here for three days though yeah and in that museum there was um something self-made that was um i want to watch that on netflix so, um, that was a, a movie that was oh, 
cookie? recommended. Yep, so, and I can catch up on the Bridgerton <laughs> because I haven't seen, I've never you seen that. Like cookies. And um, like now all of the things that people have recommended to me on Netflix, I can try to catch up on that. So, that's all. Pemberton to Avenue. Oh, that's just a cut through. Yeah. And rifled models. To tell them apart, one must look at the, the interior of right? the barrel. Rifled guns will have a series of ridges that spiral toward the back of the barrel, while smooth bores will have none. Another shelter in a cave in the Union lines. They eventually ended up moving into one of their former slave cabins but never lived in the White House again. The war had damaged it too much. Alice sold the house to the U.S. government in May 1900 on the condition that her parents be buried in the backyard and that the home be fully restored. Circumstances both met at the time. <coughs> I'm taking a video. was Thomas O. Selfridge, the former captain of the USS Cairo, which sunk on December the 12th.
schedule, even though we started both days at about 11 a.m. We started at a coffee shop, a different coffee shop today, and um, we went to the... What's the name of it? Huh? What was the name of it? I don't it? remember. The coffee place or something. Coffee house. Oh, the sun is super bright. Um, the coffee house or something like that. Uh, we went, and then we went to the Vicksburg National Military Park and also USS Caro Museum, which was basically all in one. It was, um, yeah, we're, we're doing sequential order, so we don't jump ahead. So, um, we, that's basically, a, there's a visitor center that, um, has a video and a little bit of displays for you to see and then it's basically a full driving experience with stops along the way. Uh, that took us from 11 to I believe it is 345, 11 o'clock to 345 so um, with coffee and everything. So that's kind of how long the experience took and then after we finished that we headed across the street to like a small White House, which is the visitor center, and we got, now you can share, what did we get? What did we just get? T we got t-shirts, so she got purple, and I don't know if he's gonna share his, but um, the boys got blue, and I got gray. It says visit Vicksburg, because we got, yeah. Isn't it hashtag visit Vicksburg? Yeah, maybe, yeah. So we got five stamps, um, and we wanna try to get some more stamps tomorrow. Uh, luckily, there are places open on uh, New Year's Eve uh, in the downtown area that we probably could walk to. So now we are headed to the tomato place um, and that's the something it's it's a place to eat and that was something we met somebody in the coffee shop yesterday I think the Highway 61 coffee shop. I bet they had tomatoes. Yeah I bet they do. Um, and she recommended this place to us. Uh, so that's our day. Um, I want french fries. In a quarter mile, the destination is on your left, 1509 Walnut Street. Is that Ho Hotel Vicksburg? Is that still I a hotel? I guess so. I don't
uh, we probably will not make it before the ball drops, which this could be like the first New Year's Eve ever that I haven't. One of my favorite things to do on New Year's Eve is to watch like the Ryan Seacrest, or it used to be the, uh, the, I can't even think of the guy's name that did it before him. That's what I usually like to do on New Year's Eve. So this could be like the first year ever that I haven't, that I'm not watching that show, but it'll be probably a little past midnight when we get home and I can watch like all the after midnight performances maybe. I don't know. Anyways, um, so today we woke up and packed the car up and we headed to the Highway 61 coffee shop again. Got some coffee and a little bit of breakfast and then we walked to the courthouse which was about $14 for our whole family to uh, go in and I feel like there I mean that was a good experience if you definitely could see like part of the old courthouse was still set up um, like it was back in the 1800s is when it was like a very old courthouse and there was lots of um, old antiques and memorabilia and things like that so I felt like that was a pretty good experience and um, so this is it that was that's the end of our trip uh, did y'all have fun? Yes. Yes? I don't want to leave. You don't want to leave yet? She has been saying for for a while now, like, why are we leaving? We only stayed three nights. Why are we staying longer? I don't want to go. Yeah, so, yeah, so, what was your favorite thing that we did on this trip? Update. All right, major update here. We are 31 minutes away from Bucky's. All right, so we got 30 minutes here. Uh, yep. We have been, the kids have watched Milan and 101 Dalmatians has been on. Uh, AJ has oh, been yeah. listening to some kind of podcast oh, about smart home and that kind of technology guys. stuff. They talk about home theaters, all kinds of different HT stuff. guys. Okay, so, and talk. now this girl back here has um, started a, a, a game for us. She has her Chick-fil-A question card, so I figured it would be fun to film our answers, and you can feel free to answer some of the questions below in the comments with your thoughts. Yeah. Uh, my phone is out of storage, so I do not have my gimbal thing that keeps the camera steady on so my phone. I'm using. holding it with the, she's just holding the camera. Yeah, I'm using my iPad. So, all right, here we go. Take it away. What's our first question? Which movies are which movies are your all-time favorites? Okay, so my all-time favorites: The Notebook. Uh, I like How to Lose a Guy in Ten Days. Sweet Home Alabama. Um, those are ones that jumped into my head. Oh, Notting Hill. Okay. Uh, About Time. All right, what about you? Die Hard, Ghostbusters. Yeah, go uh, He likes Ghostbusters too. Yeah, you also I'm trying to think. Christmas Vacation. Party, go party, party. I'm sure there's other ones, I just can't think of right now. Yeah, the little guy back there said Pop Caddy Shack. Which, which the little girl said um, that that's a TV show, but he also said 101 Dalmatians. Um, um, I, I like um, Paw Patrol too. Okay. That's a TV show. But what's your favorite movie? <laughs> My favorite movie is... Probably Moana. WandaVision. Oh, WandaVision. That's yeah, I like show. WandaVision too. <laughs> It's also a TV, TV show, though. Show. Come on, give me a movie. Uh, okay, my favorite movie. <laughs> but I usually just watch TV shows. Uh, you like what you do. That's not a TV show. That's not a movie. Okay. Okay, my favorite movie is Harry Potter. My favorite movie. I know, I know, I know Cinderella. Oh, Cinderella's a good one. Yeah. Okay. Next question. Oh, this is gonna be a hard one. 
I'm all about the Sensodyne. Uh, the Sensodyne I, is pretty good. I, I know, I know. I definitely know. Okay. It's the... I do not know what it's called, so I'm just going to say the color. Maybe. I use the Arm and Hammer. Yeah. Extra white, white name. Uh, white, red... <laughs> Simba up there too? Was the monkey yeah. there holding There's Simba? No, but huh? the monkey! Okay. What's the baboon's name? Rafiki! Rafiki! And Rafiki, yeah. He was there holding little Simba. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Rafiki! Who was it, Kaven? Rafiki! Okay. Rafiki? <laughs> okay. Alright, next. next. Which foods remind you of your favorite holiday? Turkey. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Turkey. Oh, wait. That's not a holiday. Jay, we should make our own turkey. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know how we did that one time? You should do that. You want to do that? Cookies. Oh, Holly, you get cookies every day of the week. I just feel cookies. like, you know, we have. Cake. Cake. For the actual cake. holidays, we kind of gone no. away. Jesus is cake. Jesus is cake. Ah, okay. okay. No. Silencio, por favor. Okay. Publix dinners, by the way, and the what's Cracker the other one? Barrel. Cracker Barrel. They're very delicious. I mean, seriously, it's the way to go. I like, think Publix has got a slight edge, though. It makes it makes the it makes the holidays hey. less stressful. Jenny, what do you think about Publix versus Cracker Barrel? What would you rank them? I, I, we are getting some serious personally. Rank. No, it's not. It's like foggy, spritzy red. Hey, well, how would you rank Publix compared to Cracker Barrel? I personally. It's out of the back of that truck. Hey, but um, I uh, I give uh, Publix the slight edge. Really? Yeah. I'm good with either of them. I think they're both good, but I thought 
Publix was a little better back then. Okay. Do y'all like my hungry, uh, here's my hungry calipero neck. I'm sporting the neck so nicely. All right, all right, next question. Next question! Oh, did you drop them all? No. Okay. So much you never get Not tired so of them. Like so so I don't know. I For me, it's kind of like I. I don't know if I think of certain songs. I mean, like right now when I think music, it's all about Coldplay for King and Country. Um, oh, I'm really loving like during the Christmas season. During the Christmas yeah. season, Light Light of the World by uh, Lauren Dangle. Hey, Jenny, I think we're about to go through that tunnel. Oh, okay. And, um, <laughs> what about, what, Mommy, music, songs, Toby Mac, those are like my people, oh, here we go, we're in the tunnel, woo! And, and that is, that's why it's kind of dark now. I like yep. Metallica. Okay. That's how I answer the question. Oh, Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol. That's your song. Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol. Yeah, likes Paw Patrol. Look at this. Sing the whole, sing the whole, um. Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol. Banjee, you're not even fog advisory. They must get a lot of fog here. It's pretty foggy. Well, I mean, I can see. It's not like the visibility is like three foot. I mean. Okay. It, it's pretty bad though. They must okay, have bad. That's a bad uh, fog advisors here. Okay. All right. Next question. Which season do you look forward to the most? Uh, this is a hard one too because I feel like all the seasons. That's true. Um. Well, I think I don't know. So Easter. I'm pretty much. Yeah. Because I think each season offers something unique for all of us. I'm, I'm a summer girl, but also I really love fall. I really love fall. When we get to put the fall decorations out, I love the fall colors. I love the fall scents. Oh, and one thing when it was fall, um, I like Scarecrow Club, too. That's true, yeah. Is it supposed to be the top of the year? 21, yes. 18 minutes from Bucky's. We have, we have some serious, serious fog it's here. It's not that bad, Jane. No, let, let's, Wait, let's move the iPad around right. so we can see. I like, can see the cars. Like, look, you can't even see. Yeah, but that's the ocean over there. But look, look ahead of you. You can see the cars. You're good. Okay, now I've lost my position. Where's the little boy at? Because he hasn't been in this film at all. Oh, there he is, right there. He does exist. <laughs> He's back there. We can hear him, but he's not showing on the, the way Ready? I got this. Okay, let's go. Next question. Okay. Baseball season. Yeah. Which season is your favorite? Baseball season. Which which season do you look forward to most? The baseball season. Summer. Summer, winter, spring, or fall? Christmas. Christmas? Yeah. So that would be winter. winter yeah. yeah. Next question. Which new language would you like to learn? Spanish. Okay. Hola. Hola. Como estas? Hola, mi tío. Yeah. Hola. What does como estas mean? Me amo. How are you? Oh. Also, 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 balcony means balcony. Okay. Which do you prefer, chocolate, vanilla, or strawberry? Chocolate. Vanilla. Chocolate. That's not easy. That is easy, isn't it? It's chocolate. That's the only answer. Yeah. yeah anything other than chocolate nice. is wrong. Yeah. Only I, I, I like strawberries and. Yeah. 
I just put strawberries on my chocolate ice cream. Next question. Which plant would you want to grow in a garden? Watermelon. Sure. Oh, watermelon. <laughs> Hey, we're trying to grow watermelon, so we'll see. We'll have to check and see when we get home with the watermelon sprouted. <laughs> Straw strawberries, tomatoes. That's right. What about bananas? Watermelon. Watermelon. What about bananas? I'm growing bananas and yes, watermelon banana. and lettuce. Banana. Alright, next question. Okay. Hey, look at the boat out there. Ships that sail on the shore of this. Next question. Which pet from my book or show would you choose as your own? What? Say that again? Just gotta remember, don't do, don't feed them after midnight. Give them anything to drink. Huh? No, Gizmo. You get a Gizmo. Gizmo. I saw that. I saw that on YouTube. Okay. And the, the, that go, he was walking, going to the cookies when they were sleeping, and then he turned into a goblin. And See? Yeah. Patisol? No, Patisol. Paw Patrol. Oh, you want a Paw Patrol? Do you want Marshall? No, Chase. You want a Chase? Ooh, this is gonna be a hard one. What if you could only have What if you could only have Rubble? Hard one. Ready for the hard one. What if, what if Chase Which? said no? What about would you take Rubble? No. Take. Which oncoming events are you excited about? Yeah, do you look at the fox gone? Which upcoming events am I excited about? Yeah. New Year's. Oh, tomorrow is New Well, tonight is New Year's Eve, so that's always exciting, except it's different because we're in a car. And we've never been in a car, I don't think, on New Year's Eve, but that's okay. Um, so that's exciting. And then New Year's Day, uh, we're going over to Mimi's house to Mama. eat the, the traditional, now that's home cooking, the traditional New Year's Day meal. And, and you don't think Publix caters that yet? What else do we have coming up? We have our, our community is doing a, a scavenger Taco hunt. Tuesday. That's kind of fun. When is the Taco Tuesday? Tuesday? Oh, we, can, we can have a Taco Tuesday. I can get some tacos. Mm. We can have Taco Tuesday. Um, what other kind of Taco. events are coming Taco. up? That's Taco. exciting. Taco. Taco. Um, what are you trying I to want say, to have I Taco. want to have people Taco. over Chocolate. to... Chocolate Thursday. To watch a movie like in our backyard or something outside with, the, with our new projector screen. And I want to make cappuccinos for people and I want to work on my latte art. That counts as events, right? What about you? Boo, does that all sound bad? That is true, and actually, yeah, 
there's this funny part of me that uh, would have liked to have been some kind of like actress on the Wiggles or something, you know? Like, well, it's just a, you know, like or, or like a, on a WEDU show or something like like some kind of like educational show where I get to just act really silly and goofy and I get to teach and. So oh, I think like that I think I, yeah I think that would always be a, a or, uh, <laughs> what's what's the guy's name that does all the stuff on YouTube now that makes a ton of money like Blippi yeah yeah, Blippi. yeah like a person like that yeah the old blipster yeah ten minutes huh yeah 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 which which plant would you like to which For me, you see the big Bucky signs? Here's one more. 
biscuits for breakfast. So I think we're gonna, I think we pretty much accomplished it because we're almost here at Bucky's. So this was a good activity to get us to Bucky's. Mm -hmm. yes. Good. It, it took the whole 30 minutes. It was good. We've all right, may the adventures that lie ahead bring you joy, growth, and experiences that inspire you to be the best teacher and mom God created you to be. Have a happy day. Bye. I don't see it. There ain't no Bucky sign. No, there ain't no Bucky sign. Where is it? We're almost at Bucky's. Where is it? Hey, um, hey, what do, you, what, do you, what do you think, um, show them, show them, show them, just show them, just show them. What's the beaver's name? Bucky. Oh, you think he is? Yeah, because it says Bucky's, but Bucky's is me. Stay in the left lane. But my, um, Apple Watch. Checked it out? Yeah, I love that feature. I did, I tried, you know how I paid for gas, Jenny? I used my phone. I didn't even... Well, you, I, probably, see, I've never, hey, you can swipe that and probably pay for gas. Hey, how do you... Oh, yeah, do you have that's to, nice. Do you have to double pump the button or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I've never used my phone to pay for anything, but now I got this yeah, Apple Watch right and you set it up and that's fun. We're paying Pensacola. with it. Okay, so we have finished our Bucky and stop. I, I, I got apples and peanut butter. Yep, and yeah. we're going to... Eggs, um, he got eggs, cheese, ham, apple, no, um, no, um. Now we're gonna be home about no, quarter till one. And, um, You're gonna have to do the late night shift, Jenny. Cheese. Oh, you cheese. be okay driving at night? Yeah, so, so they explained everything that was in his tray, the, the cheese and the chicken and the egg and the grapes. So he got a little tray, a little sampler tray, snack tray. It. Oh, they did. Um, and then she got apples and peanut butter. And what did you get? The brisket, the sliced brisket. Mm. A bowl of appetite. And mommy got nothing said just. Yeah, I didn't She's get any food. She's tired of Bucky's. She's Bucky'd out. <laughs> um, I got a drink though, of 89 cents extra large. Look at this Bucky's drink. 89 cents. And I got a suicide because. Um, I started with Arizona watermelon and that was too sweet and then so then I added um, Honor Palmer half and half and I wasn't really digging that either and so then I put I topped it off with some Gatorade orange so I've got a suicide but she went to the to the, the cooler to get a Gatorade and I said oh just get an 89 cent huge one and they had Gatorade there and then uh, but no but you said it tastes good, right? You like it, my drink? It's sugary, it's sweet, kids will love it. Okay. All right. On the road again. Do, 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 do. Ah. Oh. Sam over there? Oh, yeah. Happy yeah. New Year's oh, yeah. Eve fireworks. Oh, I can't see it on your screen. Yeah, today. yeah I saw it. it. It's just like little flickers. There's some UFOs. It's, uh, let's see, 7 o'clock. 8. Night time. 8, actually. So we got about 4 more hours. Uh, we got 5 hours. Uh, 5 hours, sorry. It's been a while. Uh, I think it's been a while. I think I'm going to let you take over a little bit. Alright. Not seeing any more fireworks, but that was fun no, I think for we're back out the New Year's Eve. 5 hours to go.